Hello. Technology is transforming every aspect of our lives, including the way our teachers instruct and the way that our students learn. I am Superintendent Dr. Tanja Williams, and in today's episode, we'll learn how the Buffalo Public Schools is on the cutting edge of using technology as one of the first urban school districts to embrace one-to-one -one classrooms. Providing a computer and or tablet for every student improves education, encourages interactive learning, and it gets our students ready for the digital age. Having the latest technology in our classrooms helps our students develop skills like collaboration, personalized learning, and more. More effective communication between the teachers and the students. Now, let's learn more about how we've integrated technology into the Buffalo Public Schools. The educational technology revolution isn't coming, it's here. And the Buffalo Public Schools is leading the effort to utilize its power to lead our students into becoming the leaders of tomorrow. This is a story of us. Our mission, to inspire, support, and empower teachers and students across the district. To accomplish our mission, the Instructional Technology Department focuses on three primary areas, working productively with leadership teams, helping teachers move to a more student-centered learning approach and creating productive learning experiences in centers. So, how does all this work? We begin with school leadership teams. ITCs work with these teams to support their building initiatives and goals with the focus on vertical alignment of technology skills and the development of best practices that support the curriculum. The process begins by taking a step back and looking at the big picture. The Instructional Technology Department provides leadership teams from every building the opportunity to take part in a vision day. School leadership teams work collaboratively with ITCs and teams from other buildings to deepen their understanding of the technological shifts taking place in society and education. We then spend time identifying the key behaviors and skills students need to be successful in the workforce they will enter. Teams build a plan for deployment, identify management strategies, and prepare for a full rollout plan to teachers, students, and community. Once the vision has been developed, our focus turns to the classroom. ITCs work side by side with other coaches and teachers to begin transforming teaching and learning. The coaching process provides an opportunity for teachers to plan with coaches, develop new skills practices, co-teach lessons, and reflect on progress. This gives teachers a chance to become more familiar with digital tools, explore new ways to deliver content, and most importantly, learn how to choose the best tool for the task. As teachers become more familiar with the devices and comfortable with their new teaching role, classroom experiences become more transformational, leading to experiences that were previously impossible. This is my third year with the iPads, and I've noticed a change in the children. They're more engaged. They're able to do more complex tasks because they're more engaged. It's less of a fight with them. Also, as I'm getting better with them and we can do more interesting things, I just see the higher level thinking skills really come into play and I see them doing some really amazing things. The goal? To provide students with more opportunities for product-driven learning, authentic collaboration, STEAM activities, and learning beyond the classroom walls. We do this by utilizing a variety of technologies like 3D printing, digital video production, and virtual learning environments. In addition, Teachers and coaches are focused on creating productive learning experiences through the use of centers. Centers provide students with opportunities to hone specific skills, apply curricular knowledge, and create meaningful products, all providing teachers with individualized feedback to inform their instruction. Our classrooms continue to fill with new, innovative technologies, and the way we teach and the way students learn will continue to evolve. The IT department will inspire, support, and empower teachers and students to expand learning beyond the classroom walls and school day so that graduates receive not only academic knowledge but the skills needed to be successful in the workforce they will enter. Wow! The ways in which our students are being taught truly seem unthinkable to many of us not so long ago. 
That's all the time we have for today. But while I still have you, please check out our new Instagram account at our handle at Buffalo Public Schools and hit follow to get all kinds of great content that will shine a spotlight on our students and staff. Until next time, peace. Whoa, whoa.